Hello Marvel fans, and welcome to an exciting look into the future of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. As we dive into the realm of superheroes, cosmic adventures and untold possibilities, in 2024 and 2025 Marvel Studios has a cast that will keep you on the edge of your seat as you eagerly await the next chapter of this extraordinary saga. Let's take a look at the cosmic stories and movies that await us. If you still haven't subscribed to the channel, I would appreciate it if you could not be selfish and take one second to subscribe to the channel and like the video. First on our list. Madam Web. Get ready for a stellar cast that promises to bring Madam Web to life. Dakota Johnson takes the lead as Cassandra Webb, aka Madam Web, joined by Sidney Sweeney, Celeste O'Connor, Isabella Merced, Tahar Rahim, Emma Roberts, Mike Epps, Adam Scott, and Zosha Mamet. With such talent on board, we can expect a cinematic journey like no other. While the plot for Madam Web remains shrouded in secrecy, the anticipation for what this clairvoyant character will unravel is palpable. Cassandra Webb, portrayed by Dakota Johnson, is an ally of Spider-Man, relying on a spider-web-shaped life support system for her survival. The movie is expected to delve into the enigmatic life of Madam Webb, offering a glimpse into her powers, struggles, and her connection to the Spider-Verse. Madam Webb, is set to unfurl within the expansive web of Sony's Spider-Man universe, standing alongside iconic titles like Venom, Morbius, Craven the Hunter, and El Muerto. As the first female-led venture in this universe, it holds a unique place, showcasing the potential for an interconnected web of stories that fans are eagerly awaiting. Deadpool 3. Get ready for a cinematic extravaganza like no other. Ryan Reynolds, our beloved Wade Wilson, is back in action, joined by none other than Hugh Jackman, reprising his iconic role as Wolverine. Morena Baccarin, Stefan Kapicic, Leslie Uggams, Karen Sony, Rob Delaney, Matthew McFadden, Emma Karin, Brianna Hildebrand, and Shioli Katsuna are all part of this star-studded ensemble. With such a powerhouse of talent, Deadpool 3 is poised to be an R-rated spectacle that'll have fans on the edge of their seats. While the plot remains shrouded in mystery, we know one thing for sure. Deadpool is about to unleash chaos in the MCU. Wade Wilson, our beloved anti-hero, joins forces with none other than Wolverine, played by Hugh Jackman. This marks Marvel Studios' first venture into the R-rated territory, embracing the essence of the Fox Deadpool films. As we anticipate their dynamic on-screen chemistry and thrilling adventures, we can only imagine the mayhem they'll leave in their wake. Ryan Reynolds, the epitome of Wade Wilson, was the first actor confirmed to make the move from Fox's X-Men franchise to Marvel Studios. This merger promises a seamless transition, and we can't wait to see Deadpool's irreverence and humor infuse the MCU with a fresh and exciting dynamic. Venom 3. Get ready for a venomous reunion. Tom Hardy is back as Eddie Brock, aka Venom, joined by Juno Temple and Chiwetel Ejiofor. With such a talented trio, Venom 3 is gearing up to be a cinematic event that'll send shivers down your spine. The plot for Venom 3 is still shrouded in mystery. But we know one thing for sure, Eddie Brock and the Venom symbiote are back for another thrilling adventure. After conquering Riot and Carnage in the previous films, the dynamic duo is ready to face a new challenge. Transported to the Marvel Cinematic Universe by Doctor Strange's spell, and quickly returned, it remains unclear what villain Venom will have to face next. Speculations abound, and it's possible that this film might connect with other characters in Sony's Spider-Man universe, like Morbius or Kraven the Hunter. And oh, the anticipation of a possible appearance by Spider-Man, now that Venom has seen him on TV in another universe, has fans on the edge of their seats. Mark your calendars for July 12, 2024. That's when, Venom 3, is set to unleash its symbiotic mayhem on the big screen. Following the success of the previous films, this installment is highly anticipated, and fans are eager to see how Eddie Brock's symbiotic journey unfolds. One of the most thrilling prospects of Venom 3 is the potential crossover with Spider-Man. With Venom now in the Marvel Cinematic Universe and a tantalizing glimpse of Spider-Man on TV, fans are hopeful for a face-off or collaboration between these iconic characters. The possibilities are endless, and the impact on the Marvel Universe could be monumental. Captain America. Brave New World. Captain America. Brave New World takes flight on July 26, 2024 showcasing Anthony Mackie's grand entrance as the MCU's Captain America. 
Initially dubbed, New World Order, this Phase 5 masterpiece promises to be a captivating adventure as we witness Sam Wilson and Joaquin Torres, the new Falcon, rise to the occasion. Their mission? Taking on the notorious Serpent Society and locking horns with the newly appointed President of the United States, Thaddeus Ross. Harrison Ford steps into the shoes of Thaddeus Thunderbolt Ross, bringing his formidable presence to the Marvel Cinematic Universe. As Ross, Ford's role sets the stage for further appearances in the Thunderbolts and beyond, showcasing the interconnected marvels that Marvel Studios is known for. Circle that date, July 26, 2024 for an action-packed experience that'll have you on the edge of your seat. Originally set for May 2024, this slight delay only builds the anticipation, ensuring that the film lives up to the legacy of Captain America. Thunderbolts. Thunderbolts offers a brilliant twist, diverging from the usual superhero narrative. The cast features villains and antagonists from previous Marvel Studios projects, uniting for a mysterious mission on behalf of the United States government. In a phase where Avengers crossovers are rare, Thunderbolt stands out as the only chance to witness a major team forming during phases 4 and 5. However, this team promises a distinct vibe compared to the traditional Avengers setup. We're expecting Thunderbolts to shed light on why CIA director Valentina Allegra de Fontaine has been recruiting these morally ambiguous characters. The excitement doesn't end there. Rumors are swirling about the possible appearance of characters like the Sentry and the Red Hulk. The anticipation for this darker, grittier Marvel team-up is reaching its peak. Circle that date, December 20, 2024 and gear up for a roller coaster ride with a team of antiheroes that's sure to keep us on the edge of our seats. It's the only chance we have to witness this major team form during phases 4 and 5, and we're all here for it. Blade. While the exact plot is shrouded in mystery, we know, Blade, will present a rebooted, darker narrative in the MCU. Originally set for release in 2023, unexpected director changes led to significant rewrites mid-production. But fear not, Marvel Studios is known for their commitment to quality, and this delay only means they're dedicated to giving us an exceptional portrayal of Blade, our beloved vampire hunter. We're eager to witness Mahershala Ali wield the ebony blade, and rumors suggest that Kit Harington's Dane Whitman might make an appearance. The intrigue is sky high, and this movie has all the potential to add a gripping layer to the MCU. Set your calendar for February 14, 2025. It's the day when Blade rises, and we plunge into a shadowy world filled with vampires, action, and Marvel magic. The wait is almost over, and the excitement is palpable. Fantastic Four. After a few unsuccessful attempts by Fox, Marvel's first family, the Fantastic Four, are making their grand entrance into the MCU on May 2, 2025. The previous adaptations didn't quite hit the mark, but with Marvel Studios at the helm, we're in for a reboot that will truly do justice to this beloved team. While the full cast is yet to be revealed, we do know that John Krasinski made a variant appearance as Reed Richards, aka Mr. Fantastic, in Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. But hold your excitement, he might not be the permanent Reed Richards. Regardless, we're all eagerly waiting to see who will be bringing Sue Storm, the Invisible Woman, Johnny Storm, the Human Torch, and Ben Grimm, the Thing, to life. Taking on the directorial duties as Matt Shockman, whose previous work, including WandaVision, has garnered much acclaim. With his expertise, we're anticipating a film that not only tells a great story but visually wows us as well. This isn't just any movie, it's setting the stage for Phase 6 of the MCU. The Fantastic Four are poised to be as significant as the Avengers, influencing the course of the MCU. Imagine the crossovers and collaborations we'll witness as this iconic team finds its footing in this cinematic universe. Avengers. The Kong Dynasty. May 1, 2026. Mark that date in your calendars because it's when, Avengers. The Kong Dynasty is set to conquer the big screens. Originally slated for 2025. This highly anticipated film is the first of two Avengers flicks in Phase 6, and it's going to shake the MCU to its core. Jonathan Majors, the exceptional talent who already made waves as Kong in Ant-Man 3, is reprising his role as Nathaniel Richards, aka Kong the Conqueror. His enigmatic portrayal and complex character are sure to be a focal point of the movie. But, what's intriguing is what Kang's presence means for the future of the MCU. Destin Daniel Cretton, the mastermind behind Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings, 
is taking the director's chair for the Kong Dynasty. With his previous success, we can expect nothing short of a mind-bending cinematic experience that challenges our perceptions of time and reality. Although we're still in the dark about the intricate plot of the film, we can speculate that it will delve into Kang's ambitions, time manipulation, and possibly the formation of the MCU's new Avengers. Jeff Loveness, the talented writer from Ant-Man and the Wasp, Quantumania, is penning the script, promising a narrative that will keep us at the edge of our seats. This film isn't just another superhero flick. Avengers. The Kong Dynasty is a key building block for the MCU's future, setting the stage for what's to come in Phase 6 and beyond. Kong the Conqueror is a formidable adversary, and his presence will undoubtedly send ripples through the MCU. Avengers Secret Wars, May 7, 2027, is when, Avengers, Secret Wars, will grace our screens. This movie, originally intended to close the multiverse saga in 2025, was met with some delays, but now it's on track to deliver an epic finale. One face you can't forget is Jonathan Majors, reprising his role as Nathaniel Richards, aka Kong the Conqueror. His presence in this movie suggests a pivotal role, and given Kang's intricate connection to the multiverse, we're in for a wild ride. Avengers. Secret Wars is inspired by the legendary Marvel Comics Secret Wars events from 1984 and 2015. These events involve epic incursions threatening the existence of the Marvel Universe. Translating this to the big screen means our beloved MCU world might face cataclysmic changes, and Earth's mightiest heroes will have to unite to save the day. The incursions could pose a threat unlike anything we've seen before, challenging the very fabric of reality. Heroes from various corners of the multiverse might have to team up, bringing back familiar faces and introducing new ones. It's a showdown that could alter the MCU landscape forever. As of now, the director for Avengers, Secret Wars, remains a mystery. However, Loki head writer Michael Waldron, a rising star in the MCU, is crafting the screenplay. With his track record, we can expect a story that keeps us at the edge of our seats. Armor Wars. Get ready to power up because, Armor Wars, is coming to the big screen. Although the release date is yet to be confirmed, the anticipation is at an all-time high. Don Cheadle is stepping into the spotlight, reprising his role as James, Rhodey, Rhodes, aka War Machine, in his first solo film. Originally conceived as a Disney Plus TV series, Armor Wars, underwent a transformation and emerged as a feature film. This move is set to give us a deeper look into Rhodey's character and his journey following the events of, Avengers, Endgame. Rhodey's story is expected to delve into his struggle to come to terms with the loss of his close friend and mentor, Tony Stark aka Iron Man. The weight of the legacy and the responsibility of recovering stolen Stark tech across the globe will add layers to his character. We can anticipate high-octane action as War Machine takes on the mission to retrieve stolen Stark technology. The tech-powered Marvel Cinematic Universe will surely showcase jaw-dropping battles and cutting-edge gadgetry. Given the interconnected nature of the MCU, Armor Wars is likely to feature appearances and cameos by other tech-powered heroes. Brace yourselves for unexpected team-ups and alliances as the story unfolds. While the director for Armor Wars is yet to be unveiled, we can rest assured that Marvel Studios will bring a visionary at the helm to bring Rhodey's journey to life in an epic way. Spider-Man 4 Spider-Man 4 is officially in development. That's right, true believers, our friendly neighborhood Spidey, Tom Holland, is reprising his role as Peter Parker in this highly anticipated installment, and the hype is reaching superheroic proportions. While the plot details are still shrouded in mystery, we do have some tantalizing clues. After the memory wipe shenanigans in Spider-Man No Way Home, Peter Parker is on a quest to rediscover his identity as a hero. It's a journey of self-discovery and redemption, exploring the impact of Doctor Strange's memory wipe spell on his life and relationships. But wait, there's more. The post credit scene of No Way Home gave us a peek into the Venom symbiote's lingering presence in the MCU, setting the stage for Peter Parker's struggle with the infamous black suit. This iconic storyline from the comics is a fan favorite, and witnessing Peter's internal battle against the suit's influence promises to be an electrifying ride. Shang-Chi 2 Shang-Chi 2 is officially in the works. Our charismatic hero, Simu Liu, will reprise his role as the master of martial arts in this highly anticipated sequel. 
The excitement is building, and fans of the first film are in for a treat. Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings left us with a trail of unanswered questions. The enigmatic origins of the titular rings and the future of the Ten Rings organization under new leadership are central to this sequel's narrative. We're on the edge of our seats, eagerly awaiting the revelations and twists this installment will unveil. One of the defining features of the first film was its jaw-dropping fight scenes, blending modern martial arts with homages to classic wirefighting films. It's a tradition we expect to see continue and evolve in Shang-Chi 2. The choreography is sure to be nothing short of spectacular, showcasing Shang-Chi's martial prowess in awe-inspiring sequences. In a nod to continuity and the success of the first film, we're thrilled to share that Destin Daniel Cretton, the mastermind behind, Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings, is returning to helm the sequel. His vision and directorial prowess were integral to the first film's success, and we can't wait to see how he steers the ship for Shang-Chi 2. Spider-Man, Beyond the Spider-Verse Spider-Man, Beyond the Spider-Verse After the monumental success of, Into the Spider-Verse, and the highly anticipated, Across the Spider-Verse, Sony Animation is gearing up for yet another thrilling adventure. Our favorite characters are returning, led by the incredible Shemake Moore as Miles Morales and the talented Haley Steinfeld as Gwen Stacy. Plus, we can't forget the enigmatic Oscar Isaac as Miguel O'Hara, aka Spider-Man 2099, and the amazing supporting cast. With directors Joaquim Dos Santos, Kemp Powers, and Justin K. Thompson at the helm, we're in for a web-slinging visual feast. Spider-Man, Beyond the Spider-Verse, promises to take us on an even wilder ride through the multiverse. With Miles Morales at the center of the adventure, we'll witness him striving to save not just his own world, but the very fabric of the multiverse. This movie is set to introduce a plethora of new Spider-People, expanding our Spider-Verse family and making this a ride like no other. Spider-Woman, Spider-Women, is set to bring us an all-female Spider-Man adventure, shining a spotlight on the incredible heroines of the Spider-Verse. Imagine swinging alongside Gwen Stacy's Spider-Woman, Jessica Drew's Spider-Woman, and Cindy Moon's Silk. This promises to be an empowering and exhilarating ride. Issa Rae and Haley Steinfeld are set to grace us with their talents in this animated wonder. Steinfeld, who already wowed us as Gwen Stacy in Into the Spider-Verse, is returning to her Spider-Woman role, and Ray is sure to weave her magic into the Spider-Verse as well. The chemistry and talent these two bring will undoubtedly make Spider-Women a true gem in the Spider-Verse saga. While the plot remains a mystery for now, we can expect a web of excitement and adventure. With a trio of Spider-Women, we can anticipate a thrilling narrative that delves into their unique powers, responsibilities, and how they unite to face an epic challenge. The possibilities are endless, and the anticipation is through the roof. El Muerto. Ladies and gentlemen, gather round for a glimpse into the mysterious realm of El Muerto. Now, many of you might not be familiar with this character, but fear not, for we're about to shed some light on this intriguing villain from the Spider-Verse. The casting choice for El Muerto has sent shockwaves through the fanbase. The one and only Bad Bunny, the chart-topping artist and emerging actor, is set to step into the ring as El Muerto. His involvement adds a unique flavor to this cinematic journey, and fans are eager to witness how he brings this character to life. The plot of El Muerto is shrouded in secrecy, with details kept hidden like a wrestler's true identity. We do know that El Muerto is a wrestler with superhuman strength, and his clash with Spider-Man in the comics certainly hints at epic showdowns in the movie. But how this larger-than-life character will fit into the Spider-Verse remains a tantalizing mystery. Originally, El Muerto was set to grace the big screen on January 12, 2024, but alas, the release date vanished faster than a magician's trick. The whispers of cancellation stirred the pot, leaving fans anxious for updates. Bad Bunny's standout role in Bullet Train had us all buzzing, and the anticipation for his portrayal of El Muerto has only grown since then. Production delays have left us in a holding pattern, with filming yet to commence as initially planned. Gareth Dunnett Elkoser is penning the script, and director Jonas Cuaron is primed to bring his vision to life. The gears may be turning a bit slower, but this could mean the team is gearing up for something truly spectacular. Jackpot. Jackpot, a name that carries a legacy of power and responsibility within the Marvel Comics universe. A moniker used not by one, but by two remarkable individuals, each with their own unique journey and approach to heroism. 
Sarah Errett, a scientist at an Oscorp subsidiary, and Alana Jobson, both have their stories etched in tragedy and determination. The themes of power and responsibility lie at the heart of their tales, making them potential compelling on-screen heroes. As we dive into this mysterious venture, the casting remains a puzzle, waiting to be solved. Who will take on the mantle of jackpot in this cinematic adaptation? Will it be Sarah Errett, whose DNA was altered by a volatile virus, or perhaps Alana Jobson, who gave herself powers through the mutant growth hormone? The choices are as tantalizing as the narrative itself. The journey of bringing jackpot to life began in 2020 when Mark Guggenheim took up the quill to craft the screenplay. The vision behind the script promises to capture the essence of Jackpot's complex journey, delving into the depths of identity, choices, and the burden of wielding great power. Though much about Jackpot remains shrouded in mystery, one thing is certain. This tale has the potential to spin a web of intrigue and captivate audiences on the big screen. The anticipation for casting choices, the director's vision, and the unveiling of the plot summary keeps us on the edge of our seats, waiting for the big reveal. Hypno Hustler. In the comics, the Hypno Hustler uses his power of persuasion with his hypnotic guitar. This concept opens up countless possibilities for an exciting big screen adaptation. The role of Antoine Delswan, aka Hypno Hustler, is set to be embodied by none other than the multi talented Donald Glover. This revelation in December 2022 sent shockwaves through the Spidey fandom. Donald Glover, known for his previous connection to the Spider Verse as Aaron Davis, is now taking center stage as this obscure yet fascinating Marvel villain. The project gains more depth as Miles Murphy, the son of comedy legend Eddie Murphy, takes up the pen to craft the script. Miles' creativity promises to bring forth a captivating narrative that showcases the potential of Hypno Hustler's hypnotic abilities. How will the story unfold? How will Hypno Hustler's guitar prowess be adapted for the silver screen? These questions keep us all in suspense. One intriguing aspect is whether Donald Glover's portrayal of Hypno Hustler will bear any connection to his previous roles within the Spider-Verse, notably as Aaron Davis. The possibility of tying these narratives together adds an exciting layer to an already mesmerizing prospect. The Marvel Cinematic Universe is not limited to the silver screen. It's a vast and expanding universe of storytelling that spills over into the world of television. Let's take a look at some of the incredible TV shows that are on the horizon. Echo. Marvel Studios' Echo is set to break new ground in the franchise by adopting a binge-worthy release format, every episode dropping simultaneously. Alakwa Cox, who made a remarkable debut as Maya Lopez, aka Echo, in Hawkeye, is now poised to take center stage in this much-anticipated series. In Hawkeye, we witnessed Echo initially portrayed as a secondary antagonist, entangled in a complex web of relationships and loyalties. However, as the story unfolded, she discovered her uncle Wilson Fisk, also known as Kingpin, was responsible for her father's demise. This revelation sets the stage for the transformation of Maya Lopez into Echo, a resilient and multifaceted character. Echo promises to delve deeper into Maya's character. As she returns to her hometown, she aims to reconnect with her Native American heritage and embrace the profound meaning of family and community. This journey of self-discovery is bound to add layers of complexity to the already rich tapestry of the MCU. What sets Echo apart is its interconnectedness with other Marvel characters. With the return of Vincent D'Onofrio's Kingpin and Charlie Cox's Matt Murdock, aka Daredevil, the stakes are higher than ever for Maya Lopez. The consequences of her actions in New York City will undoubtedly shape her path and challenge her in unforeseen ways. X-Men, 97. Let's kick things off with the highly anticipated X-Men, 97, set to grace our screens in 2024. This series is a nostalgic trip for fans, reigniting the magic of the iconic 90s X-Men animated show. Get ready to relive the adventures of our favorite mutants in a fresh and exciting way. What If? Seasons 2. Next up, we've got, What If? Season 2, expected to drop in 2023, offering us more mind-bending alternate realities and intriguing storylines. But the excitement doesn't end there, Season 3 is already in development, promising even more twists and turns in the multiverse. Agatha. Coven of Chaos. Prepare yourselves for, Agatha. Coven of Chaos, set to bewitch us in fall 2024. This is a spin-off from the enchanting world of WandaVision, 
delving into the intriguing character of Agatha Harkness. Get ready for a deep dive into the mystical and enigmatic Marvel Zombies. In 2024, we're set to witness the undead rising in Marvel Zombies. Brace yourselves for a spine-chilling and adrenaline-pumping adventure that will showcase our beloved Marvel heroes facing off against an unprecedented and horrifying threat. Vision Solo Quest Vision Quest is another gem in the Marvel TV lineup, expected to grace our screens in 2024 or 2025. This promises to be a compelling solo venture, delving into Vision's character in a way we've never seen before. As we journey deeper into the MCU TV universe, we can't ignore the promising shows currently in development. From Iron Heart to Daredevil, Born Again, Wonder Man, a Nova series, and an untitled Marvel Wakanda series, these are projects shrouded in mystery, leaving us eager to unravel the stories that await. Stay tuned for more Marvel updates and don't forget to hit the subscribe button and like this video to stay updated. Join us as we explore the MCU TV universe and the world of cinema. See you in the next video.